Hi, this is Abhijit and you are watching AB Study Circle. Do like, comment, share and don't forget to subscribe so that you don't miss any video from AB Study Circle. In this video, we will discuss a question that is based on second law of thermodynamics. So, let's dive in. The question is like this. Figure shows a system undergoing a reversible cycle. Why it is underlined? Because this is the key to the whole question. During which it exchanges heat with three thermal reservoirs and develops 1000 kJ per minute of work. Find magnitude and direction of QB and QC. See, the whole question is summarized with the help of this figure. See, this is the thermal reservoir maintained at temperature Ta. This is the thermal reservoir maintained at temperature Tb. And this is the thermal reservoir maintained at temperature Tc where Ta is 1000 Kelvin, Tb is 300 Kelvin and Tc is 500 Kelvin. This system which is based on a reversible cycle is absorbing QA amount of heat which is equal to 5000 kJ per minute, develops a work which is equal to 1000 kJ per minute and it exchanges some heat with Tb and Tc equal to amount QB and QC. Now the question wants us to find out what is the magnitude and direction of QB and what is the direction and magnitude of QC. So let suppose the heat engine is rejecting QB and QC amount of heat to the thermal reservoirs maintained at TB and TC respectively. Okay, we have assumed this thing. This means that the heat engine or the system is rejecting heat to the thermal reservoir TB and TC. This we have assumed means we haven't got the final answer but we have assumed this. So now from first law for a cycle summation Q is equal to summation W. Okay. See, it is entering the system, that is, the system is absorbing QA amount of heat, that means it will be positive. Okay. QA, as it is leaving the system, it will be negative. Right. And W is see so from this we can have qa is equal to w plus qb plus qc also we know the value of qa as 5000 and w as 1000 so it will be 5000 is equal to 1000 plus QB plus QC ok so we have QB plus QC as equal to 4000 kilojoule per minute put this as equation 1 ok we have this 
also from Clausius inequality we have for reversible cycle cyclic integral of d cut q by t is equal to 0 for reversible right okay that means it will be qa by ta minus qb by tb minus qc by tc is equal to 0 now let's put the given values so 5000 by 1000 minus QB is unknown TB is 300 QC is unknown TC is 500 is equal to 0 when you simplify this it will be QB 5QB plus 3QC is equal to 7500 this is your second equation from this when we simplify this we got this so we put this as equation 2 now see these are the two equations and there are two unknowns so we will be solving these two equations from 1 and 2 we have qb as minus 2250 kJ per minute and QC as 6250 kilojoule per minute ok we got this now see QB is minus so as it is minus that means the direction we have proposed or supposed before is wrong and it will be the reversed direction so after analyzing QB is absorbed by the system and QC is rejected by the system with QB equal to 2250 kJ per minute and QC equal to 625 6250 kilojoule per minute 